Hey guys, how's it going? We are changing things up a little bit today because it is supposed to be what, like? Like blistering hot. 107 degrees yeah. today. Mm -hmm. Nobody wants to be out gardening in that. So we are gonna go do some shopping, probably garden centers, antiquing. I don't know if we're gonna be hitting our normal spots. We are hitting our normal coffee spot, yeah. first thing. That's and, where we're at right now. And lunch. Yes, lunch. And so snacks. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can tell what our focus is. Yeah. So we just thought we'd bring you along for the day and yeah, we're just gonna have a good time. What do you think this one is right here? I don't know, it looks good. It does look I always good. am a fan of poppy seed, anything. Yeah? Mm -hmm, I love it. Almond poppy seed, lemon poppy well, seed. Well, didn't get my teeth. Well, there's that. <laughs> <laughs> Although I like the cookies. Oh, with the bagel with all the poppy seeds on it, yum. Oh. You know what, these are always calling my name. Right here. Oh, I think I better have this. That'll Seriously. be good. Yeah. Dipped in my espresso. Oh, are you or getting my, a? My coffee? Are you getting americano? Yes. Thank you very much. Cheers. Cheers. All right, guys. Here's our first stop. We're at Adams Gardens. What's the address? Uh, Nampa, I think. It's in Nampa. Yeah. Yeah. Is there anything you're looking for today in particular? Wherever we stop, garden or antique. Uh, well, I do think I'm looking for some baskets. I've been looking for baskets. Okay. Um, and I think that's about it. Just whatever I see. That's Perfect. Good. I've actually never been to this place, so I'm excited to take a look around. Just looks like a small family operated business, which that's what we do. It's fun to see some of these really neat plants up yeah. here. There's a spruce, Norway spruce of some pendula. If I see an yes, Avis pendula. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, Coriolis. That is gorgeous. It is pretty. Look at that. That's as big as my face. You should put your face up next to it. We can compare. <laughs> no. <laughs> no? <laughs> There's a really neat espalier specimen over here. We could not figure out what it was from the car. Isn't that cool? It's a beach. Seriously? Yeah. I've never seen anything like, like that. Like from a distance we thought, oh, is it a Japanese maple? No. Is it a buckthorn? No. I like that. There's a that. couple of them. Yeah, they're really neat. And they're doing the full sun. Yeah, they sure are. Oh my goodness, there's a huge yard of plants back there. Wow. So, this is from Bountiful Farms. Okay. Yeah, which we so order you, from. Yeah, you do order from them. Oh, we got some pottery and containers in here. I love these. Look at how huge that bonsai bowl is. Or Isn't that Container, pretty? that is yeah. so neat. And I think this one's really pretty color. I don't think I've ever seen one this shape that big. No, me either. Yeah. That's really neat. Oh, look at this little container, Mom. Oh, oh, I like Isn't that. Isn't that cool? Yes. Couldn't you do it, a neat succulent thing in there? Yes, but or a moss bowl. Oh, Wouldn't yeah. Wouldn't that be beautiful? But what do you think? It's 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 the top of something, like it goes on top of a post, a four by four post, or something like that. Do you think you can screw it down, maybe? Oh, possibly, yeah. And have it be a bird feeder. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. Those are cool planters too, right there. Yeah, they are. Little scoops. Kind of the same idea with this yeah. one, but this one has little feet like it is a pot. Right. Oh, how cute. Oh, cute. We used to have these little, yes. do you still have those we little do. ones? We have a few. Yeah, we don't have many left. Oh, and then there's some terracotta over here. I love this look right here. Oh, this Maybe is a too. new one. Look at that. Yeah, those are really fun. Those are those are really pretty. I might have to get one of those. Yeah. Maybe ooh, maybe we'll get the. Or is that a pair? Yeah, a pair. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. Oh, look at that's a great price. Yes, it is six ninety wow, nine US. Yeah, is it really. And like, what is the seven ninety nine for the saucer? That is so inexpensive. It is so inexpensive. So I'll take these up for you. Here I'll get. I got them. Here I get this. I got them. These are a neat set too, Mom. Yeah, they are. Are those twenty four ninety nine for all three? Yeah, that's a really good price. They're really pretty. You know what? Yeah. There we go. Look at these, you guys. Aren't these neat? Oh. Solar lit decor. Got some neat looking hats over here. They're cute. Oh, mom, this is the Chitalpa. Oh, I'm, I'm filming myself. I'm in oh, mom. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Who makes fun of their mom for doing that? I did not realize. This is the Chitopa. How'd they get one? These are brand new for next year. Really? Smell, you should smell them. I wonder 
It's a desert willow and catalpa blend. Mm. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Oh, and the bees like it. Look at that. Yeah. They look like a frilly, yeah. like snapdragon. Yeah. And they get four to six feet tall and wide. Yeah, they're really awesome. What zone? Uh, ours, five through nine, really? I think. Yeah. Wow. All right, guys. So check this out. My goodness. So they've got a bunch of tree racks. They're full. Perennials. Yeah. Shade stuff. Wow. This is you like know, a little hidden treasure. It is a hidden treasure. You know, when you drive up, you can see the front of the business and then like a couple greenhouses, but you don't see any of this that's back behind it. And it just goes on a distance and oh, there's a lot of bonsai stuff. Yeah, really? Look at these. This is a neat one. Look at that. Oh, that's Isn't that cool. Fun. A it's fur? a AB's Cor Coriana yeah. Icebreaker. Oh, that's a pretty color. It is really neat. Those look like, like bottle brushes. You know who something. would like to get into bonsai? Benjamin. Uh, or Aaron. Oh, One Aaron. of the two, yeah. Yeah, he would. Yeah. Oh, Plumbago, Mom. <gasps> oh. Oh, our car is going to be 107 today. Yeah, but still, that could hold up to Do you that. think so? Yeah, now, where did they get that from? This is Plum... <laughs> Okay. This is the Plumbago I was telling you guys about when we were doing a video by the pond recently. It's an amazing kind of ground cover. This you is need, Sarah. You need all of this. I do need all of yeah, that. Yeah. Um, so this one grows 12 feet tall or 12 feet, 12 inches tall by 24 inches it's wide. The other side. And it turns the most brilliant bright red in the fall. Is that all Sarah, you see, all Mom? I'm coming around, honey. I'm going to get it for you and take it to the oh. counter. So you just hand it through the window. <laughs> oh, I know we should. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Mom. Uh-huh. Ooh, look at these. The Hinoki Cypress. Those are beautiful. Thowell Hinoki Cypress grows six feet by two feet. Oh, that's a beauty. Hookahs are great looking as well. Evening gown hookra. Oh, what is this evergreen? What is this? That is so pretty. Cryptomeria japonica. Snake branch Japanese cedar grows 15 by 8. Look at that thing. That is gorgeous. Look at how it comes up on a single stem and then it just like poofs into this little firework display. That is just beautiful. My goodness. Now, this one would probably like center part shade. I'm guessing in an area like ours, a part shade situation like it's in right now is probably ideal isn't it cool and i also like this mattress fine oh what is this that'd be neat tucked oh. around some rocks yes it would be mm -hmm. nana mattress mm -hmm. fine nana you need some of that <laughs> you need some around the rocks in your pond it's a zone five through eleven yeah dang it looks like a shade lover it says center, center part shade it. so but wouldn't that need... be pretty yeah because it, really it, really it would just creep around like a yeah. rug mattress fine mm -hmm. hey there's some spruce lollipops do you need any for your containers uh, we have some oh at you work. do because yeah. look at those look nice over there i need to have two yeah there's we've two. got some just like it oh perfect yeah oh look there's littler ones they're so cool looking uh-huh this looks like a wild poof <laughs> the um Hoken hinoki cypress over there are really pretty too it's really nice it's different having it irrigated overhead yes it is really cools it down. This is a pretty Gallardia. I yeah. like the seed heads on Gallardia yeah. just as much as I like the flower. I agree. They're so neat looking. Yeah. There's some Oryngium or something. It looks like it. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. So they must be growers as well, Laura, because look at all their hoop houses. Oh yeah. I wonder, let's walk back there here in mm -hmm. a second. Yeah. I wanted to see what was right here. <laughs> oh, it's, supposed to, it's 107 degrees. Let's not garden today. <laughs> This is what we love to do, though. It is. These see them are on the west side of the shed, so they're going to get blasted with sun this afternoon. They're going to love it. I love the um, this type. This is turquoise tails. It's I really think it's because it looks fluffy. Yeah. Fluffy and soft. Yep. Because sometimes succulents can look hard. Hey, look. There's some more plumbago. Bigger Ooh. ones. Oh, big ones. Yeah. I'll have to probably swing back by this one and get those. I'll get them on a wagon. On our way. Look, there's a wagon right Let's there. Let's just get them on our way back. Okay. There's a bunch of roses over here, some more benches. And then this is a neat, look at this, Mom. That's kind of a neat statue. Well, it's one of the mythology. Yeah. Like, well, what I does it say? I don't know which one it is. Hercules. Hercules. Yeah. I think that's kind of neat. Look at that. He's got that 
Joe needs that in his yard. That's his favorite movie. <laughs> we should tell him. Yeah. I'll, I'll get together and get him gift cards for that. Yeah. <laughs> What's that purple blooming like? Is that a... Is that status? It looks like status, yeah. Huh. Yes, it is status. Interesting. Is it perennial status? Is that a thing? Yeah. That's pretty. Well, the status that I grew from your plugs that you gave me, yeah. that the cows loved it. Oh. oh. <laughs> and they loved the onions too. Oh. Mom and dad have two cows out at their house and they broke into the vegetable garden slash flower garden that's near the chicken barn and devastated some of the crops in there this year. Naughty cows. They, yeah, total naughties. They they did not eat the potatoes. They stepped on them. Yeah. But they didn't eat they them. They knew because not they're in the, Yeah, they yeah. knew not. Oh, they are full of stuff, Mom. Look at this. Oh, my word. Oh, this one doesn't have anything in it right now, but this one does. Yeah. I wonder if these are back stock, you suppose? I don't know. I don't think they'd mind if we no, walked through here. Mind. Oh, it's hot in here. It's a sauna. Oh, it's, it's a sauna. Like a, it's like a sauna. Okay, now I love this. That's really pretty. It looks very delicate looking. It looks almost like a clematis, doesn't it? Is it a campanula? Um, well, it is a phlox. Oh, my. Isn't that pretty? That's really neat. You yeah. should get some. It's so pretty. Yeah. I love the blushy Balloon pink. flower. Platycodon. What's the zone? Uh, zone is three through nine. Oh, they're pretty. Yeah, should we get a few of them? Yeah. Okay, fruit trees back here. Yeah. Oh. Look at oh, that. Oh, that's a John Gold. Yeah. Monica was telling me the other day about how there were specific strawberry plants that everybody was watching these strawberries ripen and mm -hmm. all the, you know, people down at Andrews were so excited to taste these strawberries and Monica said she walk, watched in horror as a customer went up and ate every single one of the strawberries. <laughs> <laughs> and Monica said she was just like <laughs> watching, watching from a distance. <laughs> Those little it, treats that you hungry. get. But yes, I you guess I guess she was. Oh, look at this, you guys! Look at all the evergreens. Let's go take a look at these. Are big. Yeah, they are. I like them because they show up mm -hmm. like against other evergreens. Look uh -huh. at how pretty that is. I know we need some that. we need some rain boots. Yeah, out here. <laughs> what are these? Let's see. I Oh, Laura, oh, of course. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is a variegated Japanese red pine. That is really pretty. Isn't it pretty? Erin would be loading that thing up with chelated iron. <laughs> I know. A lot of people think that. But yeah. for me, when a plant's supposed to be gold, it looks good. Yeah. If it's iron deficient, it doesn't look good. No, it doesn't. It, it looks different than There's a, a gold yeah. plant. To Erin, there is no difference. Oh, I know. A lot of people in our area feel that way. Yeah. They're like, no, I want nothing gold in my yard because right. I already battled that. The uh, spruce, look at these, mom. <gasps> look at I these. I was just gonna say, look at the cones. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that is so cute. Is this just a regular, what is this? This is a compact Engelman spruce. Oh, we have those. That's really Not pretty. Not that big a specimen, but you that's know nice what it is, Laura? One. You think they'd mind if we do a little trimming on that? A little trimming. <laughs> <laughs> we could do some crafts with those cones. Hey, we could forage in here. We could forage in here. They, they may not appreciate it. They'll be no. watching us like Monica watched the strawberry lady. <laughs> they'd ban us and have our pictures. They would. Our mug shots <laughs> with, uh, behind the counter. With, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, we found a few things we can grab. Balloon flower platycodon. I don't see where it says phlox anywhere, Mom. Well, where did I see that? Maybe. Oh, right here. Oh, no. It, it says uh, astro pink. Astro oh. pink. I thought it said phlox. How many do you want? <laughs> well, probably. There's two, four, six, seven. Better, better take them okay. all. Well, maybe. Those are like very soft pink. Yeah, I like that. That's a really nice color. Now, yeah. what does it say? Bloom time. Summer. They're so throughout the now, summer. So. And look at how neat the little the oh, unopened I balloons. I love that. The little balloon. Yeah. Sun apart shade. That's my whole yard. Yeah. Oh, I always have a place to tuck these in. Oh, yeah. They only get 8 to 10 inches tall, so it's perfect. Yeah, that's perfecto. Got the goods? I got them. Nice. Here's our haul, you guys. Successful Laura, first stop. That was fun. Yeah. This was really fun. Look at this, you guys. So fun. All right. Oh, let's get this air conditioner up. Yes. Come on. So now we are going to head to what's the place? Um, it's called Site One. Site One. It's a landscaping, like, hardscape supply store, I, I right? I could be wrong about that. Hang on a second. 
It's a, a place where we're going to pick out some pavers for mom and dad's new area outside once the renovation on yes. the back side of their house is done. Yeah. Site one. Okay. It is called. Yeah. Site one. I was right. Perfect. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Next stop, we're at Site One Landscape Supply in Beridian yeah. to pick out your stone. Let's yes. take a look. Ooh, look at that stone right there, the top one. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah. But come look at some of these over here. I think I see the color palette. See that second one, the bottom? Yes. See that one? Oh, yeah. Isn't that pretty? That is pretty. And I want it to be more like real stone, but I want it to be gauged. Yeah. So, but I don't know how thick this is. But that looks nice for the actual floor of the deck. Yeah, it does. Oh, I like this. Look, that's exactly. Yeah, that's two inches, isn't it? What do you think or of close? the color? I like it. Now, it has a little bit of blonde in it. It does. This might, well, my glasses make it look darker. Does it? Okay. Yeah. So everybody knows. Look at these without your glasses. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> my sunglasses make everything look orange. I call it the death filter. Oh. Makes things look like it's dying. Oh. So I stopped like wearing it them. Like it rust. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you it's know what, really though? pretty though. Think of this though, honey. Think of this with uh, the sealer on it. It'll bring out the yeah. colors. Mm -hmm. so it'll darken it up. It will. Because it's going to have a sealer on it. But In I the like... car, you were just saying you wanted grays and browns, no yes. blondes, no orange, yes. no red. That's right. So let's go look. Okay. <laughs> let's go look and see. Let's look but at the other like one over there. That style yeah. for the actual decking part. Yeah. And then and you the... want varying sizes. You don't want big slabs. Well, I kind of wanted big slabs. Mm -hmm. But that's a close, that's a that, close That one. is really pretty. Yeah, that is pretty. And I want them close like that. Well, and your eye went straight to that. It did. Yeah. Yeah, it did. But, well, but with my glasses on, they looked a little bit darker. This one up top is so Isn't that pretty? pretty. Yeah, that's beautiful. Now that's a really thin, that's probably just a sample though, I'm guessing, yeah. right? No, that's not know. thin. No, that's the, that yeah. one. Isn't that Isn't pretty? That beautiful? So that's gray <gasps> and brown. But look at that's only one inch. Yeah, that's really thin. I wonder if they can do different. I don't know. Sizes. But that's see, so this pretty. is what I'm thinking about. Something like this, uh -huh. you know what I mean? Like, yeah. the, but maybe bigger pieces. Uh -huh. And then when you pop down into the, the pa you know, a little pathway going to the garden, that's mm -hmm. the same stone as what's in the garden. Yeah. So that's what we'll do. Stones and bricks and things are so hard to pick out because they're so expensive. Yeah. And you feel like they're a little bit more of a permanent thing. It's not like putting down mulch. This is the Victorian. Yeah. Okay. So, can I show you the smaller version too real quick? Oh, and this is the texture Oh, one. it colors. would have the colors. So that's the oh, color. that's really pretty. That what do you think? Yeah. six, so they've got a smaller scale. The 12 yeah. is just bigger. Yeah. So your 12 would be, this would be a six, six by, by 12. 12 by 12 and a 12 by 18. Oh, I love these. Isn't that beautiful? This, yes, I love that. But it does have a little bit of ridgy. The, the texture. Yeah, and I think I want flat. Flat, okay. For the for where we're going to walk and set tables and things like that, I yeah, want flat. that would be nice. So this is the one that she's going with dimensions 12 in the color Victorian right there. This one right here, except for bigger stones and sealed. This one's not sealed. Right. And it won't be wavy. No. It'll be this right here. It'll be more smooth. Yeah. I wonder if they've got it over here. I don't see it. This is the color no. uh, right here, but it'll just be the smooth it'll version smooth. of that. And it'll be about these sizes. I think that's a nice color because it's not too dark. I do too. And it's not too light. Well, and it'll it's go just, with just perfect. Yes. <laughs> um, it'll go with our other rocks, our other yeah pathway pavers because your other pathway pavers have a little more tan in them so yeah. it's probably good to have a little yeah. bit of that so exciting yay yay <laughs> next stop is lunch double yay yeah. <laughs> we're at a restaurant called crave which we have come to one other time when we've uh, brought you guys along for one of our shopping days and we really enjoyed the lunch so i'm excited to try it again crave <laughs> it's quite the sign it is Or okay. This is the rosemary focaccia that was to die for. Rosemary. Okay, let's get that. Yeah. Oh my goodness gracious. Now what is this again? Rosemary for yes, focaccia bread. But it's unlike any focaccia I've ever had. Usually I'm used to it is a rectangle. Yeah. And this is it's so melt in your mouth. Yum. Um, it's like ricotta cheese with uh, honey and something. And this is lunch. Oh my word. It smells so, so good. Mm, mushrooms and chicken and Parmesan and wonderful noodles. Yum. Mm. Oh my goodness. Well, I enjoyed my lunch. It was wonderful. It was really good. I think the appetizer was my favorite. Uh, yeah. It was that rosemary wonderful. garlic kind of Couldn't flavor. You just have that and a good drink and then yes. you're, that's good. That's where, we, that's where we should have stopped. I know. 
<laughs> anyway, right now we're gonna head to mom's meeting and then I think we might make just one more nursery stop on our way home. The plants look like they're holding up. They, they did it. They did it. Yes. They did a great job. All right, guys, last stop. Mom's gonna be waiting in the car because it is 107 right now. But we are at Jaker, the re, re wholesale nursery. I just recently planted those Asian moon buddleia and I uh, mentioned that I needed one more to kind of finish that hedge. And we thought, you know what? We are kind of in the vicinity. Let's just swing by, see if they have any left so I could pick up that one so that I don't have to keep my eyes open forever. Sometimes, you know, you're missing like one or two plants of a certain variety. It takes you like two years to, to find to find those plants again. So anyway, I'm gonna run to the office, see what they've got, and then hopefully we go home with one today. Oh my goodness. There we go. All right, perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, let me double check. That one is Asian Moon, yes. <laughs> awesome, thank you so, so much. I'm gonna get it loaded actually inside, I think, today. Have a good rest of your day. Bye. They just got a big batch of fresh ones. I'm like, ooh, can I pop mine out and take some of these <laughs> fresh ones instead? Last up before we get home, what's it called? I don't know. Some Jim or Bob's or something like Jim that. Jim or Bob's. <laughs> I don't know. It's it's a real short man's name. And, 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 and what? And they have milkshakes? <laughs> Peanut butter milkshakes. <laughs> the best. Peanut butter milkshakes. So that's where we're <laughs> heading next. All right, mom. So now I, I wanted you to have the camera because I have something to show you up here that Aaron and I discovered on a drive. Okay. Okay. You should look right here. As we turn this corner, whoever lives in this house. Oh my gosh. Does a fantastic job oh, of making it look amazing. Oh my gosh. Look at that. And both sides of the road oh, too. Oh my word. Yep. Yeah. yeah it's you over see that? here. Yep. There's rows of. Uh, oh. Boy, oh, I, I better okay. make sure there's no other cars. Oh my gosh. <laughs> But Thank you, whoever's doing this. This is so beautiful. It's so beautiful. And there's, look at, they've got a hose. Like they make the yeah. effort to drag a hose around. Yeah, zinnias, marigolds, oh. cosmos, flocks that are looking gorgeous. But even right in here, like oh look at all this. Oh my gosh, all along the road. And then look at this side. Now let me unroll my window. <sighs> look at this side, you guys. And somebody's out there uh, cutting hay right now. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Now this look is at this. so like, oh my gosh, oh, over the top, beautiful. How gorgeous. All with the poop, purple loose drive there. <laughs> <laughs> and the cows. Oh, and the cows. This whole little valley is so picturesque yeah. to me. It smells so good right now with the hay being It cut. does, yep. It's just beautiful out here. Yeah. Burger Q. <laughs> Are we going in or do they have a drive through? They have a drive through. Ooh, let's hit it. Yeah, see that white pickup? Yep, just gotten ahead of us. Perfect. So Burger Q in Middleton, Idaho. That's where we're at. Yeah. How's that tasting? It's the best. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> oh. Uh-huh. Yummy. Mm -hmm. So good. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. <laughs> All right, guys, we are gonna head on home. And then when we get there, I'll lay everything that we got today out and we'll take a look. All right, guys, so this is what we ended up with. Mom got seven of these beautiful Astra Pink balloon flowers. I got seven one gallon plumbago, beautiful bloom, and four of the four inchers, which are right back here. And then the butterfly bush and some containers. So two sets of these right here, and then two larger ones with saucers that match. Successful day. It is. And you got your stones picked out. That was a huge check mark off yes, the list. Huge. Yeah. Oh, and you guys, that is gonna do it for today. It's actually 108 degrees out here right now. So a little bit hotter than we even thought it was supposed to get. So other than getting these plants watered and put somewhere where they can be in a little bit of shade, uh, we're gonna spend the rest of the afternoon inside. And I'll probably go around, I usually do rounds at the end of the evening, like right at dusk. Uh, when it's cool off a little bit, we'll just check everything for water, give it, anything that needs it a little bit of a drink. That's kind of the name of the game when it's so hot. So tomorrow is 105 and then we're gonna have a major cool down. In fact, I think we're gonna have two evenings where it's really breezy because we're gonna be dropping by 11 degrees one of the nights and I think 10 degrees the other night. So uh, we're getting down, down into lower temperatures, which is great but that does usually mean some pretty good wind. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was sure fun to get out 
uh, out of town, even though we ended up outside a lot of the day uh, looking at things and still like being out in the heat. It's different when you can be in and out of the air conditioned car and you're doing something fun and and you're together just having a good time. We had a lot of fun uh, snack stops along the way. So it's just been a great day. Hope you guys enjoyed it and we will see you in the next video. Bye.